I'm back with another video. Back with another. Before I start doing anything with my hair, I go ahead and lay my edges down and I set it. So it'd be good to go when I get done. My hair is literally blow dried out. Like I haven't done anything to my hair. I'm gonna drop the link below how I laid my closure down because it, it was about three weeks that I went, no, two weeks. It's been two weeks since I had a touch up on my closure. But anyway, I'm gonna drop the video down below. It will be in the description and you'll be able to see how I laid my closure down. So what you will need is a wand curl. This is Con Air and I've had this for about five or six years this lasts me a long time so that's good about one curlers they do last you a long time then you're gonna need some heat protectant some holding spray and comb or brush whichever is your choice I'm gonna take my wide tooth comb i will be taking my thermal spray this is cantu spray it on there oh my god it smells really good it has like a coconut smell to it. The settings on here, it goes from 310, 330, 360, and 400. I have it on 330 right now. I got my curl about right here. I'm not gonna do the whole full hair curl. So I typically, I leave mine on for like 30 seconds. And like I said, if I wanted a tighter curl, I would leave it on for like uh 60. So I'm counting. 10, 11. I let it go and I hurry up and catch the curl and I press it, press it. If this is your first time wand curling, then I feel like I need to tell you this. You don't have to spray it, you don't have to spray each strand. Spray the heat protectant one time on the section and that's it. So, as you can see, this is 30 seconds, this is 50 seconds. The 50 second one is a more tighter curl, as you can see, it's drawing up. And like I said, the longer you hold it, the tighter the curl will be. We, the less that you hold it, the looser the curl will be. But before I speed the video up, I just want to say, most worn curlers do come with gloves. Me, I, I'm okay with the heat. It doesn't burn, but if you get too close, it does sting a little bit. Like you can feel the heat, like it doesn't actually sting you. But for me, I'm okay with it. So I don't use the um, glove. But if this your first time wand curling, I do recommend using the glove if you're scared to get burnt. If you can handle a little of a stinging, then you should be okay. But me, I've been wand curling for years and this heat literally is nothing to me. done with this side now i'm going to start on this side when i do my right side i go from back to front if that makes sense back to front so i start with a section in the back i'm going to spray heat protecting all over I always position the one curl down and I wrap the hair back like this. Back, back. And then release it. And this is the finishing look. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. I personally love one curling my hair because I love when my hair is big and full. And I feel like one curls, they do that for me. 
they last longer usually this hairstyle lasts me about three days so i hope you guys enjoyed this video because i enjoyed making it of course so yeah leave a thumbs up subscribe share this video tell everybody to check out the channel i have many more more videos coming for you guys and yeah so i'll see you in my next video